EA Sports. It's in the game. I'm Gary Thorne along with Bill Clement. Welcome. Great to have you with us for our hockey broadcast here tonight. We're at the United Center in Chicago where the Blackhawks have made a lot of history. This one between the Chicago Blackhawks and the Calgary Flames. The Blackhawks skaters love to just go, 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 but can they tonight? I, I don't know. I always like the trapping team when they're playing against a rush team because rush teams end up turning the puck over. We'll see. To board. Two on two the other way. Rocket shot, and he got that in a scoring situation. Well, on the boards, that puck keeps moving, but nobody's got a pretty good handle on it. Taves. In the neutral zone. Puck checks it away. To Seabrook. Offense underway. D to D pass along the blue line. Pressure offensively. Grabs that in the slot. Scoring opportunity, quick chance. Pretty good chance right there and a nice blocker save. Chicago's decision on that last matchup early in this game, not a good one. Well, listen, they're going to have to focus on getting a shutdown group out there because this scoring line is on fire, it looks like. To Shostro. That one's blistered on the snapshot. Rebound shot. Got to move this. They're moving in in front of the net to Kane. Wants to get the offense going as he comes through center ice. Two versus D. Wrist shot on. Calgary's attempt to intimidate. That's what you're looking at. Yeah, they don't skate by anybody. This coaching staff demands that everybody finishes their check just the way this player did. Uses the stick. Good poke check. That's knocked away. To board. Blackhawks getting the whistle. That's an icing call. Chicago Blackhawks fans, part of the great history here, Bill, and we love doing games, and it was that great old building. Yeah, but sadly, the great history has not involved many Stanley Cups. you got to go back to 1961 before you see the last time the Hawks won. To Shostro. Good sheet of ice right there all the way up to the point. That one's not going to go anywhere. Be careful. He's got to move that to Campbell, to Kopeski. Oh, gain some room. Scoring chance down low. Save made. Beautiful save. A couple in a row. Chicago's checking line has come out for this face-off, Bill. Yeah, to face the other checking line, I'm already looking forward to scoring line facing scoring line, because that's what's going to happen next. To Sopel. Through center ice to Boy. Good poke check to free that puck up. That puck's just going to hit him and rebound away. Nice play. A lot of body slamming going on here. That puck up against the boards to Brower. 
Hardy needs to clear this puck, trying to find a way out. He's got it in the slot. To Primo. Picks that one up in the offensive zone. Intercepted in the defensive end. Picks that puck up at the point. Not a lot of room over there to move. A couple of players coming together along the wall. To Bowmeister. Found some room in the offensive corner as he went wide with that dump. Under two minutes left here in the first period. And this one remains scoreless. Play goes on, but there's a delayed penalty coming. The Flames are going to go in the PK here as they get two minutes for high sticking. Well, I don't know. This is just a breakdown in discipline to me. Keep your stick at least below your shoulders or you're going to get called like this guy did. The Flames got their first opportunity to kill off a penalty as they bring that unit out on the ice. One back to Kane. Move back up to the point. Defensive effort for his goaltender. He'll move that from the front of the net. Closing in on the final minute of play here in the period. To Sharp. Tremendous hit. Well, this is what makes Robin Regeer really tough to play against. Hits like this, he is feeling it out there. Glenn Cross got that one out of there in time. To Tate. First 20 minutes are done. Chicago's rest of the crew gang didn't do a whole lot to help the, and the goaltender. Without a doubt. I mean, your goaltender has to bail you out at times, and they can look at their goaltender and say, thank you for that first period. Calgary's effort here, try and kill off that penalty that was picked up at the end of the last period. We began the second stanza of this one. There's the faceoff for period number two. Looking back to the point. Skates this puck, front of the net. PK unit gets it done. They move it out of the zone. Good pass to get it up ice along the side. Under pressure back in that defensive zone. Calgary's penalty is over. The player returning to the ice here, and they'll be at even strength. Offensive chance. That's a great place for a shot. And the boards take those two in to Tate. Takes that one up the wing. opportunity. Picks that one up. Wants to clear it out of there. Good play with a stick. To Glenn Cross. To Borg. Keith's play is changing a little bit right now. Just nailing people. I mean, he's a human battering ram now. Tremendous scoring chances. Look at the moves in the zone. Nobody's got control of that puck yet. Good scrum along the wall. Nice pass. That one stayed on the ice up to the point. The Blackhawks passing game. It may be moving the puck around, but it's not moving it towards the net. No, defensively, it's great. I mean, you know that the guys are going to run out of gas from passing, so you just sit there and watch till their tank's on empty. To Seabrook. That baby's burning. Seabrook to Brower. Grabs it in the shot, scores! And the first goal to be scored in this game. When you're an enforcer, I know you tried that in practice, but I mean, come on. Gary, I can see the guy's chuckling on the bench. He's not supposed to be able to do this. 
Chicago's offense finally gets it going. Into the second period, they find a goal. That's big. This is a defensive struggle. You got one, might be enough. Ben assisted by number 22. Troy. Chance. Shot gets blocked. Cleanly handles the puck in his offensive end. Good wrist shot. Real quick blocker move right there. Nice play in that save to Glenn Cross. Homerson. Yep. To Kopeski. Snap that one on net. Nice glove save. Kippersoff's going to cover that one up. And you'd really have a tough time disliking Craig Conroy, a man that's in the lineup tonight. Born and raised in Potsdam, New York, and attended Clarkson College. He has got the wheels and the hands to go with the speed. He could be an offensive big guy in this game. Cross ice to Giordano. To Showstrom. Nice wrist. Delayed penalty coming up. With that whistle on the delayed call, let's see who that was on. Chicago's assess the penalty. Two minutes interference. Boy, I like this call. A lot of times the refs are looking at the puck. Not this time. It was away from the play. Good call on the interference. Calgary's on the power play. They're first of the game. Face off one back to the point. That had a chance to go home. Good pad effort. He didn't intend to block that shot. Just happened to be in the right place. To Aginla. There's a pass up ice. That'll go to the point. Save made. In the defensive end. Pass back in behind the net. That'll be gloved. All right, fisticuffs, let's go. We'll get the majors as they head off the ice, and uh, by the looks of them, they're going to need the time. They're just going to make friends with the guys that are the timekeepers in the penalty box. You know, they have great relationships. The Blackhawks penalty killing unit tonight will get their first chance to see what they look like. To board. Chance to create some opportunities here as he comes up the wing. Over six minutes left to go here in the second period. The Blackhawks involved in a tight game here. This is about defense. Very few shots, fewer goals. Makes the move. He's got a scoring chance. Good save with the glove. That one had a chance to find Twine. Takes that one up the wing. The Lanko. Tremendous hit right there. Both of them are going to feel that one. To Brower. Two on two on the rush. Chicago's penalty has concluded. And we're back to full force. Back up onto the point on that pass from down low. To Homerson. Four. To Glenn Cross. Oh, got rid of that one in a hurry. Save made. To Versteeg. To Homerson. Makes the move in the offensive zone. He's got it. Swiveled it into the ice. Great scoring position and a save made. That puck right up through center ice. There's an off. And he scores. Seabrook's goal, look where he was, Bill. He looked like he was lost, and then he was found. Well, there's the offense that they wanted. With that last goal, they have stretched this lead, but there's still a lot of time left. And I think that's the enemy. Sometimes you can go soft with a big lead if you get it too early. Brian Campbell, time of the goal, 18 minutes. 39 seconds. Regeer to Boyd. Offensive opportunity, three on two. And with the horn, we complete our second period of play in this game. The Flames' handle on the puck has not added up to much time here. No, and they've got to be more aggressive, Gary. They have to go and end up with more time of possession.
And here we go in the third. There's the faceoff. Brought in on the offside. To Bowmeister. Sharp to Seabrook. He's looking to pick up something on the point department. He's already got two, but with this tight game, he'd love to get another. Good pass along that wing. Has that puck under control in his offensive zone. At the point to Sharp. Regeer to Aginla. Carries this one through the neutral zone. Third period of action underway. Chicago's last score in the second period. Put them up by two. They still have that lead. The Blackhawks' inability to find some room in the slot to shoot early in the game has changed. They're still there, but now it's open. Boy, a lot of teams would have gone to the dump and chase because their passion plays just haven't been working. That is until now. Now they're starting to click. Big time shot. That might have gone home if he hadn't looked back. He covers it up. Well, not only good awareness to pick this puck up visually behind him, but then to squash it with the glove hand and get the whistle. Nice play. Draws one back in the backhand. Blocker deflection right there. That's a good chance. That one's not going through on the pad side. Picks that one up in front of his own net. Pretty good defensive pressure right there. Marker to Campbell. Chicago's turnover advantage in this game continues to climb. It's like they're dogs on raw meat, Gary, and they can't change their game plan. Keep playing like this. To Showstrom. Two on two the other way. Eager. Boy, there's a hit on the ice you're going to want to watch again. That's a tremendous collision. Now oh, these two teams are just flat out hard to play against. Physical teams, and they are showing it with the number of hits we are seeing. Add that one. Iron up. We've got a penalty coming. Delayed call. Let's see what this is. And another penalty in this game as he skates over to uh, tell us what it is. The Flames are going to have to play this one one short. Two minutes, slashing. Oh, man, this has got to hurt. He two-handed him. Slashing, two minutes. The Blackhawks' second power play chance of the game, not converting on that first one, makes this one vital. Two minutes for slashing. Time of the penalty, 11 minutes. Good coverage. He's got to move this puck to Seabrook. That one covered some ground all the way up to the neutral zone. Shot! Great use of the glove right there. What a save. Plays that puck in front of his own net. To Glenn Cross. Dumps that thing hard into the zone. Seabrook. To Keith. Shoots that one up the wall. The Flames will touch that one up. That'll be an icing call. Playing here in the third period, Chicago scored the last goal. That came in the second period. They lead by two. To Bowmeister. Gets that one up near the point. Kick save and a good scoring opportunity. Two versus Steve. To Marion Hosa. Gets down low. That's a good angle shot. Nice save with the pad. Didn't intend to get down in front of that shot, but he blocked it. Calgary's penalty is over. They survived the PK in a big one as we close in on the end of this game. To Primo. Two on two the other way. Takes a shot. Pets. He shoots. He scores. Be in the right place and keep your stick down. Yeah, drive the net and good things will happen.
The Flames. Skaters getting the job done here late in the third period. Yeah, a lot of teams would have just rolled over and quit. Not these guys. Very impressive. That puck being carried along the boards up through the neutral zone. Goaltender back in behind the net. Stick handles to Keith. There's a good return pass along the ice. Again, look. To Regeer. To board. that one down using the pad. Heats on. Dangerous territory. Up the wing side to Lav. Great dink. He's got room. Kicks that one out with the pad. Makes the save from behind him. Well, this puck was in a dangerous spot behind him, and it was a race between his glove and the attacker's sticks. The Blackhawks' chance to hang on to a lead that's been tenuous at best is now really tenuous. Gary, I know you might want to build the confidence of some players, but now is not the time to put your worst defensive line out there when you're trying to hold a lead. Chance to catch up. Time running out. Going to have a blast here in the third. Up the wing to Sharp. That'll keep this offense going. He's got it. Oh, he wristed that one. Puck under control at the point. Look at the scrum going on there. Big time battle for that puck up against the wall. Picks it up in the offensive end. Trying to get something going along the blue line. D to D pass. He scores! Big goal late in the third. That's going to give him a two goal edge and time running down. The great shooters know if you're going to get a goal, one of the ways you're going to go is up. Yep, over the blocker glove. And you have to miss the handle of the stick as well. All he got was net. The Blackhawks' lead is now two, and time's running out. Gary, I love this. They could have sat back and maybe rope a their way to a one-goal win. Not these guys. They went after it. Oh, he's leaving everybody behind him. What magic in the offensive end. And he's got that one covered. Face-off coming. A lot of shots have been faced here in this period. He's uh, really had to do Yeoman's work tonight. Gary hasn't been able to stop them all, but he is the only reason the score isn't worse. One back to Keith, to Kane, Jokinen, to Regeer, to Bowmeister, to Borg. Jokin in sight on that one right on the money. He read that and takes it away. That's a major league collision right there. What a shot. Oh, well, there is another hit. These two teams aren't going to stop until the final buzzer. Black and blue for everyone. And that's going to do it. Chicago's win in this tight game, and the time of possession mattered. Yeah, Gary, and the, and the one thing that you've got to avoid when you're a puck possession team is turnovers. They did. And with this one completed, let's take a look at the three star selections for this effort. Number 55, Ben Eager. Tonight's second star for Chicago, number 51, Brian Campbell. Tonight's first star for Chicago, number seven, Trent Seabrook. I'm Gary Thornton along with Bill Clement. Thank you for joining us, everybody. On behalf of EA Sports, we bid you adieu.